more Magic Craft here. I have been determined and obsessed to finish the game. Not finish the game, but at least do one completed run and finish the third stage and see what the final boss looks like. I haven't been able to do it, but we've been learning lots. So let's try to break the game today and finish it off. All right, we're going back in. You know what? Get me a costume change. Looks great, looks great. I do like this one better by quite a bit. One, like, I haven't seen any of these wild berries. Chance to find a, a berry bush that drops goodies in the forest of runes. I seriously haven't seen that yet. Um, secret path, it can heal you. Let's do it. Shop refresher. Refreshed four times. Okay, that that is actually really good because then you can just really focus on finding specific items. I've just been going on a whim for my builds, which I like doing, especially when it's the beginning of your experience with the game, so that you, you know, are forced to experiment with things, right? And I like that. So those berry bushes, I, I assume that they would appear differently than other bushes. The other thing that could happen with them is that they actually look like trees or normal bushes or something, and then you, you have to break them before you find out. I don't know. Pillar of Light and Volley. For every one additional shootable spell, the MP cost of these spells, 87% and scatter is 6 degrees. Okay, so we're casting both of them. It is a stronger cast, but it costs a lot of a lot of mana. So let's be a little bit more conservative. Get wrecked. Killing it. I might go on a rampage and break every single tree. Because I feel like maybe I'm missing something with that berry bush. And maybe there's stuff in the trees. I, I actually don't break trees too often. It just takes way too much time. <laughs> Alright, you know what? If there was something happening with trees, I think it would have happened already. I'm going to finish off just this room, but if nothing happens that's beneficial with the trees, I'm just going to say it doesn't actually yield anything. Surely enough, I think that's a good enough test. I'm going to go for some spells here. Oh, I forgot to equip all the rest of my stuff. How did I get hit? The frick? Let's put this back. We have Birth Cord, which doesn't help us. Orbit, which could help us. We get an Orbit in here instead. That doesn't work out well. Do we want to Orbit Butterflies? No, that also doesn't really work out that well. So we want Volley back. Orbit is really good with this particular wand. Because you can just stretch out and just orbit things into people's faces. Whereas usually with the normal wand, you would have to walk up to them and it would orbit around you. So I do like orbit on this one in particular. Or not this one, but with the magic robe that lets you extend. Thunderstorm and orbit though is pretty cool. I think that's good. I think I could probably use that. Actually, I'm just going to use the Thunderstorm, I think. Is this enough? I like that it lasts a long time. My builds have been looking very same lately, but I mean, it's... <laughs> I don't know, I guess I'm sticking with what I know. Oh god, this is terrible. I just want the barrels without doing too much adjustment. Cool. And then we have six-sided die, which will let us re-roll. Or we can take max HP, body size, recoils less. I'll take the crit damage. It's a safe choice. And I'll also risk my life for that. Closer observation. Display and unit HP. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll fight the boss like this. We double zap him? We can. 
So we want him in the middle of all of the circles of damage. Ooh! No, you don't. Oh, how did that hit me? Look at my head! Why is my head extended? What in heaven's name happened to me? I'm, I'm taking hits because I'm just gawking at this weird stuff that's happening on the screen. Oh, it's part of the um, closer observation item. It's so weird looking. Okay, I took way too much damage doing stupid stuff here. Alright, he's dead. At least I made it through, my god. I don't like this. I usually use the head as an indication of where my character is standing. It's kind of like um, Binding of Isaac when you take the guillotine. I always get so confused with that item, I really don't like it. And this is kind of reminds me of it because I, I feel like I'm like picking up items underneath the head, but it's actually the body that's picking it up, obviously. So we have stagnant space. We have charge per meter of moving distance. I love it. That is exactly what I like to hear. We go like that, and um, it will just cast a bunch of pillars and a bunch of butterflies out of nowhere. Where's the butterfly? Ugh. It's not great. <laughs> it's not great, but it's, it's definitely better than nothing. Alright, those can't get hit with the electricity. Oh, that was a dodge. That was a dodge. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, get wrecked. Sweet. So I'm gonna switch over to Arcane Explosion just for a quick sec. No, not with Orbit. Actually, I should put that over here. So if I put Orbit over here, this like this, and I just put this over here. I can use it just for, like, when I'm breaking boxes, basically. Summon a homing soul that deals 65 damage. When standing still, reduce casting interval. Cool down and scatter up to 60% when standing still. I don't really stand still. Let's, let's go crit build. Uh, I'd rather use a key on the room, I think, than that chest. Oh! See, again, I thought I was being... I was standing at the head thing, you know? Oh, of course not. I gotta get used to this. It's at the bottom, isn't it? Cool. Okay. Oh, we're... Oh! My God! It didn't glow fast enough. I thought we were in the clear. Well, that's an embarrassing first attempt. Back into the dungeon. This can't, this can't be our life. This can't be our life, it's so bad. Oh, Resonance Rune! You know that's good. It's not gonna work with us right now. What's this potion? Tear of Goddess. If there happens to be five curses on me, I get to remove them all. Break this open. We have Thunderstorm again and Penetration. I'm gonna use the Arcane thingamajig because... I don't know if I like Thunderstorm by itself. 21 DPS. Actually, yes I do. <laughs> I lied. Oh! It just sucks for this particular situation because of the butterflies. Yeah, yeah, get, get wrecked. You, you need to die. It also costs a lot of money, or a lot of MP, so you can't cast it very often. You gotta kinda kite enemies into it. Really slow. Alright, we have Bone Armor. 20% chance to generate a shield around you whenever you kill an enemy. When HP is below 25, slowly recovers to 25. I'm taking it, it's rare. Oh god. Okay, yeah. Jump into this thing, guys. Come here. Just mosey on over into this electricity pool. Nice. So we have Lucky Clover. Merlin's hat is 
good, especially this early into the game. I'm gonna take it. What's the curse smell like? A curse that changes over time. I'm willing to take the risk. Not sure if that was worth it. All items in the current room will be sold at a discount. Sweet. I'm gonna take the HP up here. It would be nice to switch around some of my spells, but not super vital. You know, we can we can survive for a bit just doing this. It's gonna be boring and it sucks, but we can do it. Get over here. Not enough keys, damn it. Drop a key. Please drop a key. Ah, he didn't do it. Alright, I got 12 bucks. It's not gonna do us too much good, but maybe with the discount potion, we could. Alright, I'm gonna take the risk. 17 bucks for this thing. And it gives us four points for every critical hit. That's not gonna charge really fast, to be honest with you. This is a laser. I mean, it could shoot lasers a lot. Would it shoot two of them? Because it only costs two? I don't know. I don't really like the stuff I'm seeing, so we're gonna refresh. Ew. I mean, we do need a resonance rune again, but I... I'd rather... Wait, you know what? We're going to get a wand from this thing. One more refresh. Ugh, maybe I should have taken that first one. Maybe, you know what? Maybe a snake would be good. I kind of feel weird using it with such small purchases, but... I'll take this, and I'll take this, and we're just gonna call it a day. Should we use a snake? 30 DPS? Or we can use that. I feel like it'll be easier to hit a boss with this. How did I get hurt there? Not right there, but like, right, right before I entered the door, I think I took some damage. Freaking boulder. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got the moves, baby. Please don't. No! Hit the wall. Thank god. That's the way to do it. You just stand near the wall. Alright, this isn't working out for me. Oh my god. Okay. This also isn't working out so well for me. <laughs> Should we go back to Arcane Explosion? Could you hit the wall, please? There you go. Struggle bus is real. Yeah, the snake isn't as good as I remember it. I don't know why, but I used to love it. Okay, cool. Finally. Full health. Give me something good. Ooh. Guiding Fable. It comes with a leg wire. Broken Scepter has a lot of MP and regen. However, the last damage is reduced. Interesting. Very interesting. I could use a leg wire. Because if we do the leg wire... Wait, that doesn't even make sense. Let's see what the leg wire does. So the leg wire will just explode that. If we had a volley, that would be pretty cool. Um, I might do this wait it would it make sense to do it like this let me see how far the leg wire goes so it has a limit to it it seems to go further with wait no I'm I'm crazy all right never mind we're gonna do this we actually don't even need the arcane explosion that much If we just choose which one we want to use, that would be better. I can't choose, so I'm just going to keep both of them in there. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Come on, shoot it. Yikes. Yeah, this sucks. 
I'm gonna need to switch this up. Okay. Because if we're using Resonance Room, we really just want something that shoots fast, right? So maybe I go like this. Does this make it cost more? It costs one. Oh my god, I'm getting hurt. I don't know if it makes sense to have a snake coming out of a leg wire. Because at that point it comes, or it's a... Uh, once it hits the enemy, it's it's like moving past the enemy as well. So maybe I don't do that. Ah! Stuck on a bush. Are those berry bushes the ones that I was promised? Okay, that's good enough. Let's try to get some berries. Which one has more mana? 65 versus 90, okay. More spells. Give me something good. Here is a volley rebound as well. All right. Now we got some decisions to make. Arcane explosion. If we take a volley on this, how does that look like? So it explodes and then it does that. So maybe we just do this, and then we just like cast a bunch of snakes. We just don't have enough room over here to do all the good stuff. So we keep shooting these snakes, and then we hope that this staff over here can do that leg wire for us by the time we shoot enough of these freaking snakes. I think that's optimal. I think that's optimized for what we got. Oh god. Please, please, please no. Yes, give me that. Don't step in the poison. Oh, we stepped in the poison. We just barely tapped it. Give me, give me something. Resonance rune, please. It's supposed to be one in three, man. Terrible, 25 HP, not great. Keep moving. What what do I got over here? Oh yeah. It's a curse potion. Oh, of course it shoots up every single one right there, but it doesn't do it when I'm in trouble. Okay, we good. I actually hate poison in this game. Even using it myself, it just like so much poison all the time. Um I love the Gecko Tail. I know I basically use it every single game, but it's so good, how could I not? Those little Rocky Boys. Yeah, step right into it. Ah! Get this poison out of here. Who's even poisoning them? I'm definitely not poisoning. Is it that guy? There you go. I did it the chicken's way. So we have Mr. K's head. And then we also have, what was that, a laser beam? Disruption ray? Don't like disruption ray because then you can't cast anything as it's casting. Mr. K's head is interesting though. What does this look like? It, sh it shoots off from Mr. K's head. Full salvo plus two. Can it do that with the arcane explosion as well? How does that look like? Oh, it's using all of it. That's pretty crazy. So there's a super, you know, grand entrance from the Mr. K's head. I love it. Heal me up. I will use, I should have healed that before I used the altar, I think. Oh my God, I got hit, damn it. Please stop. What is this, conversion? Choose a relic and re-roll re it. Um, I might use that later. I have so much space to hold potions anyways. And we have enough keys to do this. 
Oh my god. So I do have this curse potion. If I take five of them, I can heal it right away. A bomb will appear beside you from time to time. Okay, I'll take that later, but I'm definitely healing that one off. Unfortunate, a curse that changes over time. We just had that. No problem. Teleport you back to three seconds ago every once in a while. I'll take that later as well. Lose 15% MP regeneration. Cannot attack within two seconds of taking damage. Anything locked requires one additional key. I don't know which one of these I would like to leave with. Maybe I just leave one unlocked kind of thing. So a bomb will, will show up. Does it happen right now? How often is it going to happen? Teleport you three seconds ago every once in a while. And it's healing belt. Yes! Every time we use a potion, we get some stats up. Lose 15%. Oop. The regen rate is the easiest one to swallow. Maybe I'll just take that. And then now we do all damage plus 20. That's so sick. All this stuff is so worth it. Oh my god. So we need to drink our curse potion right now. We lost everything. Hopefully this one's worth it too. Double the amount of keys you currently own and we got some HP. But we do have negative 15% regen. Oh baby. Here's another curse. And there's another potion. I'm gonna have to drink a potion to carry a potion. Which is totally fine because it gives me stats now. Oh yeah, my MP regen is terrible. <laughs> It wasn't that great before and now it's even worse. Enemies cannot detect you until you launch an attack. I personally do not care about that one the most. Uh, so I'm going to pick it up and just use the darn thing. And then the other one I'll take. What is this gonna be? Relic option negative one. Hey, wet paper bag, how's it going? Nice to see ya. I'm gonna take it. Oh, double gecko. Relic options, I, I feel like there's usually at least two I would take. And we also have a reroll. I'm doing good. Playing my favorite game at the moment, Magic Craft. About to hit up the first boss of the first map here. If we don't get hit, that will be great. Look at that, I kept my invisibility, which I did not expect through rooms. Oh, he's fast. Don't hit me! I'm faster though, which is a good thing. I'm so glad I got the Gecko's Tail. Two levels of it. Our damage output? Not great. Not good at all. Oh, you know what? Oh my god! The summoning of Mr. K's head over and over is not great. Because he just gets like, placed again, you know? Holy crap, I thought we were doing good. Woo! I don't think we got the right spells for this guy. But we do have the right relics to fight this guy. I honestly don't know how you dodge him without the moving speed. I have the slowest spells in the world. It's terrible. Why did I put myself in this situation? <laughs> No, 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 no. I, I, I desperately want to take no damage. Oh my God. Oh, this is, this is crazy. No, oh, you bastard. You little piece of poo. Oh, that's going to be the only hit he does too, huh? I hate you. I hate you so much. Eh, maybe the next boss, we'll see. Loving this game as well, been watching your YouTube videos on it. Well, then you know that I'm not that great at it. But hey, we almost got a no hit. We almost got a no hit there. Talisman of blank. Okay, we've seen this a million times. Focus, this has so many slots. When MP cost of a spell cast is lower than 10, increase the damage by 50. I actually don't care about that at all, but the amount of slots on this one is just nuts. Um, I think I'm going to take it. This one has such a low cost to items though, so maybe I'll take this as my first slot staff and then we'll just find a 
better third slot at some point. So yeah, this one will just help me feed my resonance rune. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, do I want any of this stuff? I do not. So I wonder if... Uh, no, no, I'm actually not going to take anything else. You are done with hard mode? Man, I can't even get normal mode done. I, I feel like snakes is okay. It's just like unpredictable sometimes of where they're gonna go or where enemies are gonna go and if it's gonna be effective. That's my only problem with it. But during the demo, I, I was relying on the snakes to get through, you know, all the runs that I really tried. Maybe I just need to get better at the game in other aspects. Snakes are broken if you get follow mouse. Oh, right! Yo, I forgot about that spell! I would like immediately ignore that spell, the one where it follows your mouse, because I never found a good spell that really works well with it. I tried it with like the boulder once or something and I was like, this is stupid. Um, okay, so we only have two choices, I forgot. No longer slow down while casting spells, I'll take it. We're constantly casting spells. Gain levitation until you enter the next door. Not as... Should I break this? Not as exciting as I want it to be. I can re-roll. I forgot about that for a sec. I'm gonna keep the health potion. I'm just gonna use this floating thing for now. And with speed boots, their DPS increases so much. Speed boosts? Are they based on speed? Oh, the more they travel, the more damage they do. I get it, I get it. Um, you know what? I think I'm just gonna go for normal spells here. A normal spell room. As much as I love Mr. K, I, I don't know if the... Ah, crap. I don't know if it's the best spell for us sitting around here. How often are we seeing this leg wire go off. There's one. It's supposed to be 30%. And it's not happening. Is it because of Mr. K or something? There's a leg wire. There's a leg wire. There's a leg wire. Switch it up. Leg. Okay, Mr. K is doing something weird with it. I can always summon him myself. Oh damn, disruption rate isn't cast from me if I use a leg wire. And I like that. Oh, it's probably because of MP cost, isn't it? It sure is. It is the MP cost that is preventing it from casting. All right, let's go. So we got accelerator and silent flower. Yeah, it's, it's, the, it's the MP cost. Um, so si Silent Flower would be good because I'm trying to cast a lot over here. Permanently increase max MP by negative 5 or 15. I'm gonna take the risk. Ah, crap! It, it comes out equal. Actually, I come up ahead still because I have this one relic that gives me stats every time I use a potion. Let's go into the shop. Oh, you suck. Wait, wait a minute! Right? Tracking? Right? 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 Okay, so... I mean, I, I I just want the tracking. We could also replace our first one, I guess. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Why, why is it happening this way? Um, okay, so we want this over here. Please stop! Everything! Oh, it's locked on it! Well... I guess the only thing I really need on that is the snakes anyways. Why is Mr. K's head? Okay. Yo, thanks for the tips, man. This is crazy. This is... This is crazy. Here's the accelerator. Oh, 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 Now I'm getting excited. Okay. Before we get too crazy, self-aware grimoire. So this will allow us to 
have grimoires just like floating around. I had this last time. I really liked it with the thunder actually. So we're gonna try to do that. Um, we're... How does it look like if I just go like this? The cooldown is really long. I don't know if I wanna wait that long. Bag. Uh, okay, this is this is good. This is good. I don't know if I'm gonna remember to do all my summons, but I should. I'm really bad at remembering to switch between my uh, my stabs. Although it's not that hard, it's literally a scroll of the wheel. Oh my god, this is so good. This is unbelievably good. Gain 15 points of temporary shield when entering a door, or we can recover every time we enter a door. I wonder if that stacks. I hope it does, the shield here, because I just took it. Uh oh. Like, I don't even need to recast, it's crazy. That should make it easier for me to remember to switch between my staffs so I get my grimoires out in my Mr. K, but um, it's not. Maybe during the boss fight when things are crazy. Negative four HP every time you use a potion. Now, does that mean damage or like max HP? I, I don't think I want to risk it. I like my HP. It's damage. In that case, I, I don't think it matters as much. I, I uh, just a couple of keys, not not really worth it. But here we are. Oh, this room. We get these guys out. Oh my god, this is crazy, man. I love it. So many snakes. <laughs> you were right. Wet paper bag. So good. So good. Okay, let's go over here. <clears throat> I guess I could have went to the crafting table too, but I don't know. I just like relics. When you get the oh, when you get the same up one level, their penetration as well, so they hit twice. Would penetration really matter with a snake? They already penetrate, though. Like, are you saying throw this penetration on it? Because I got one. But I just feel like that would be... Like, that wouldn't do anything, because they already infinitely, you know, penetrate through. Absorb all HP recovery, and then you get a bunch of HP. Right. Um... I, I think I'm gonna take the Merlin's hat for even more MP just to go crazy, because this Guiding Fable is taking a lot of MP to cast. Right, let's go. Let's go. Get these guys out. Oh my goodness, get wrecked. Wait, that's lasers I'm thinking about. Lasers? Like this laser? I feel like this is infinitely piercing as well. Or do you mean disruption rate? I, that's a channeled spell, so it must be... Like, you're saying penetration pl plus laser. Ah. So we have laser plus over here. Look at that. It costs so little. Can I shoot it fast? That's kind of sick, but we don't need to cast that often. Like, the, the Guiding Fable is running out of mana faster than that's happening. Um, I feel like you could break anything in this game. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, let me see if this thing does anything. Okay, it, it does give a freezing element to everything on that wand. I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Uh, it would be great to get another resonance rune or something to automate my third one. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 
I hate these guys. These laser dudes aren't my fam. Why don't you just die before you touch me? Oh, 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 oh. Man, I got two gecko legs. I should really be able to dodge anything in the game. But I am stupid and I cannot. Okay, okay, okay. Nice. All right, residence room, residence room. It is not one, but we do have a troll serum. I mean, troll serum can sit over here, right? Troll serum. And then what else did we pick up there? We had a navigation. <laughs> oh boy. I mean, I maybe, maybe we try this. Would navigation also work at the same time as the tracking? We'll see. It's pretty useless. Never mind. I'm going to take the MP regen then. Um, I feel like I might have enough spells here to be dangerous out of witch work. The navigation is good when it's one or two parts. Right. Okay. So we're just going to get rid of it and try to fish out. Definitely not doing booby trap. Oh, I do like black hole. I might keep the black hole. Let's get rid of this laser here. Mana box, wand max MP. Try to get snakes <laughs> just to upgrade it. Yeah, I guess so. Honestly, I I am more so looking... Okay, we got another accelerator. I am more so looking for another resonance, perhaps. Starred laser would be good. I don't think we need rebound. Split. All right, hear me out for a sec. Split plus a snake. Ah, oh, God, pick that up. Don't throw that away. Let me see how this looks. Oh, the split ones don't follow me again. Oh wait, do they? Okay, so they do follow me again. That's kind of crazy. Reroll the star laser. Oh right, it keeps the star. That's such a good idea. All right, well, volley is decent, but I think we're fine with just the one volley over here. Pillar of Light, Butterfly. This is not going so well. One more reroll. Oh, last reroll. Yo, you see that? I think I'm, I'm actually going to keep. Yo, I know, super lucky. I think I'm gonna keep the split, although it costs so much money or so much mana. Actually, let's let's see the DPS here. DPS is like 900 on this guy. All right, let's see it over here. It was at 1,000 when I turned away. Re recovering, recovering. Let's wait for them to split. It's about the same. Actually, I think we did do more with just more casting and more recovery. So we're gonna stick with that. All right, we're out of here. Can I do any of this? Probably not. Would be obvious if I could. I can't believe the luck on that roll. <laughs> it's a good omen. Come on, keep casting, keep casting, keep casting. Ah! Keep casting. Yeah, I'm happy I'm keeping the uh, MP regen. I'm running out of mana at some points. I'd get rid of the battery and put another speed in there. What? But I need to cast fast. No way. Oh yeah, it is pretty fast. It is pretty fast. 
But the thing about this is I can cast it a lot more. Well, I guess my other one is just running out of mana, right? Okay, let me test something out. So with a full bill of mana... With a full bill of mana, I want to see if this resonance thing is going to run out of mana from all the casting. Pretty close. Pretty close. Let me try something else here. Or just the other arrangement. Let's go. Hmm, it's pretty close. I think I'm gonna keep the battery, to be honest with you. I think I'm gonna keep the battery, sorry to say. I'm gonna go for a relic, 25 bucks is not that much. Oh! Trading health for curse recovery. I feel like the snakes are moving fast enough. I mean, more speed is better for sure, but... Oh! But for now, not too bad. Get out of here. Nice. What do we got? We got Blade of Fury. I don't like closer observation. I'm just gonna take the blade. All right, if any of these... Ah. The relic option is the one that I, I kind of want to get rid of. <laughs> 20 HP, is it worth it? I don't know. Well, we're, we've gone too far now. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. It was the last one, of course. I swear the game is listening to me. Um, I'm gonna go for another relic. Man, this thing is destroying everything. It's actually crazy how much damage it's doing. Sweet. All right, so we got another potion here. Transform 25% current HP into coins. <laughs> Max HP, negative five. If any, taken, if any damage is taken while clearing a stage, max HP plus two while clearing a stage without taking any damage. It's a little bit too risky for me. I also don't know how long it's gonna stay. I will change my HP because I have a healing potion right here if I need it later to reverse that. Dusty treasure, randomly upgrade one relic. If no relic can be upgraded, obtain a common relic instead. Or we can get healing belt level two. Crap, I should have picked that up before I drank that potion. Let's try dusty treasure. Upgraded healing belt. Oh, so it just did something that we could have chosen right there and then. Great. Um, yeah, I guess we can go into another workshop here. So if we get two more snakes, we can make this a double star, right? I've never seen a double star, but I, I think it's actually something that exists, <laughs> right? Uh, penetration... We don't need penetration here. All right, I'm kind of into keeping another split, to be honest with you. Um, could try and reroll for another speed. Oh yeah, right. Uh, let's do... Power traction, multi shot. I kind of like multi shot too. Like multi shot instead of. Oh god. I don't know actually. How does this look? Is it so many snakes that we can't see it? We're we're doubling our DPS literally. I think I'm gonna keep the multi-shot. <laughs> All right, let's uh, re-roll again. Want to keep volley? Leg wire we are using. Crap! I need more spells. Arcane explosion I actually don't care about too much, but we are using it currently. I guess it's just the split that we're not actually using. Oh, there's a snake. Silent Flower. Don't need it. Definitely don't need a Rebound. Overscatter. What exactly does Overscatter do? Is it like... Like, how does it differ from Volley? I guess you just like shoot super fast, right? Orbit. 
I'm kind of into an orbit. In fact, I would rather use orbit than a leg wire. Because then we can just do this with everything. Never found it useful. Got it. Oh wait, what the hell? Oh, we were using the disruption... Or, or sorry, we were using the... The leg wire for the disruption thing. But maybe we can just go like this. And then we can just use the electricity like that. Okay, let's... Let's stick with that. How does the Grimoire look? He's just gonna shoot lasers, right? Oh man, he takes a long time to charge that thing up. Yikes, that's not good. Uh, but anyways... Maybe we keep re-rolling the Silent Flower? God, I want to keep the battery now too. Multi-shot we are using. Accelerator we are using. I don't even know what to re-roll anymore. I guess leg wire? Don't need a rainbow. I think I could re-roll one of the orbits. And that is an extended range. That's okay, but not great. Hover is okay. No, I re-rolled it and that's it. Okay, cool. So we put the Pillar of Light there instead. And I think that's the best build we can go with for now. Too bad we didn't get another snake. Yeah, that's what we're going with. Oops. So this is actually similar to what I was running yesterday in my last run, except with a bunch of snakes. <laughs> Another multi-shot, Meteor. I have never found the Meteor. Whoa, cool. I want you shooting Meteors instead of this projectile, bro. And then I'm gonna take the snake back. Or maybe, yeah, I guess the Meteor wouldn't do anything with an orbit, would it? Let me check. Meteor can hurt me as well, so be careful. Okay, yeah, I don't like it. I don't like it. Take it out. Take it out. Indiscriminate damage? Is that what it says? Deal indiscriminate damage. Yeah, sure does. Sure does. Okay, we're not going to use it because I'm very scared of hurting myself. I've killed myself multiple times with the booby trap. So why wouldn't it happen with an even stronger spell? <laughs> Oh, these guys shoot boulders? Yeah, this snake build is too good. It is too good. Max MP again. Berserker's Eye. I'm gonna take the MP. We can cast more with it. Okay, here's a true test, okay? I feel like this should be the boss that we are able to get a no hit on. It's probably the stupid cube. But yeah, it's Cage. I should know his movement in his uh, attack patterns by now. Oh, ho, 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 my God. Get some of these guys out. Here we go. Let's see how fast we kill him. It's, it's triggering the- Oh, come on! He, I think he ran right into me there. Damn it. Wait, does shield count as getting hit? Or is it like, is it like Binding Up Isaac where it has to be like red damage? I hope it's red damage that only counts. Because that would be very good for me. Oh, perfect. Yes! That is so sick! Well, that, that gives a lot of credence or a lot of value to um, shield now. Source of all. That's a lot of MP, my friend. So we can use this. The Siege is really good too. It's gonna have a lot of damage. So I would want this for my slot 3. But honestly, I think slot 2 is more important. So I'm gonna do this. 
They are both slow. Oh, I didn't even look at that. The cooldown is 1.2 seconds. Oh, you're right. It's pretty damn slow. I think that's fast enough though, because we're only we're relying on Resonance Rune for that to cast. I th I think that's fine. Um. Yeah, I think that's fine enough. Let's go into this room. I have so much HP to do this. Picking up coins will restore the same amount of HP. Maybe. All wands slot plus one. That's a game changer. That is a game changer. You are airborne. I don't care about that one as much. I'm just going to take this. And I think that's enough HP that I've lost. So now... Could put damage up on snakes. Yeah, that's true. There's a damage up on the snakes, so we're sharing the love there. Um, will Volley work with a snake over here? Actually, I can't even freaking tell. I, I can't even tell what's happening. It does. Okay, so it casts it at the same time. Um, wait, does Volley even work with Resonance? Or does it always just cast one at a time? Okay, let's try to get a resonance cast and see if it all comes out at the same time. That put the pillars and a lightning thing at the same time, so I'm gonna assume yes it does. Um, in that case... <laughs> wait a minute, we can move some stuff over here. So we can put up a battery here and a accelerator. Wait, does that make sense? That will allow us to cast more of them. But it kind of works against us because we have a slower cooldown, so it doesn't really matter. All right, I think that's fine. Yeah, I think that's fine for now. Let's keep moving. Hell, honestly, I feel like this build will, will win the game already <laughs> with how strong it is. I'm so much stronger than I usually am. Oops! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh! 100% the fastest I've ever killed those guys. Get these guys out. Is he dead? Is everything dead? It's so great because you don't have to cast a lot of the time because you have enough snakes out. And then you can just like recover MP for- oops! You can just recover MP for like the really important parts of the fight. I love it. Give me this. And there's also a potion over here. This is all items in current room will be sold at a discount. I mean, I kind of want it. I guess we can- we don't have any keys. <laughs> Choose a relic and re-roll it. Or res restore blood. Ooh. Will this give me one key? I'm gonna do this for science. Locksmith's potion. I have none. I think in Isaac, in, when you use an item like this, it gives you one key. Doesn't do anything. It won't. Okay. Well, I did it anyways. <laughs> uh, let's go do some witch work. I don't have that much money, but I'm hoping that it's enough. So I'm not going to use Arcane Explosion anymore. Enhanced damage. We have three of them. I'm going to merge it. And we're going to put it on the snakes. Sorry, other stuff. And then we have a battery here. I'm not going to use both of them. Actually, I'm going to do the Meteor first. Disruption Ray times two. Ugh. I can kind of use that. I guess I'd rather do the battery. Mr. K's head, I don't think I need to. Rainbow. Lightning storm times three. Ugh. I guess I'll fuse it. <laughs> Might as well. Fuse that up. All right, what else do we not need here? Oh, there's a magic bullet. Obviously get rid of that. I don't really care for multiple troll serums. Viscous circle, screw that. No venomous. 
accuracy, don't need, and that is a volley. Okay, well, didn't work out the way we wanted it to, exactly, but that's okay. Um, I guess I could put you here for now, right? Yes, you can. All right, let's go get some money. Okay. You know what? This this 15 points of armor every room is actually really awesome. I rerolled re both my spiders. Oh, son of a... <laughs> no, you're right. No more spiders. <laughs> Whoopsie! It's okay, we made it through anyways. But anyways, yeah, what? which one is it giving me the 15 armor per room? Treant's Wreath. I, th I think that's like a top tier item now that I know how everything works. And I'm not taking like 15, more than 15 damage per room it seems. Uh, I don't really have enough money to go back in here. I also need more spells I feel. I've been re-rolling too much. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Look at those disruption rays. When they come out, they really do hurt, but it's so slow. Oh, that was a big dodge. More Grimoires. We did it. And it's a relic room next. No keys to open up that treasure box. It's very sad. Very, very sad. Come on. The spider is not doing anything. <laughs> oh, I'm confused. Yes, thank you. I don't want to be confused like that. Six are just a small wall of death. <laughs> yeah. And then I actually have a, a wall behind them that protects me from shots. So good. So good. Oh, 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 oh. Where is anything? Oh, there it is. Is that it? I can't see behind the, the tails and the heads of the freaking snakes. Nice, nice, nice. There you go. So we have Blade of Fury again, Berserker's Eye, or Lucky Clover. I'm gonna take the Blade of Fury here. No key to open that. We got some more spells over here. Yeah, I can't see anything, but it's a, it's kind of a good thing. At least it's killing fast enough. Because in my other runs, I was I did have a lot of effects happening from my wand, but it wasn't doing enough damage. So I couldn't see anything, and then I'd run into the things I thought were dying, but they're not actually dying kind of thing. All right, penetration again, and disruption ray again. We have three disruption rays. Uh, okay, let's go. I can at least do this. And then... Let's see, I'm going to reroll the penetration. Uh, enhanced duration may, might be good for the snakes, but I'm gonna try to roll for another snake or something. Don't need thunderstorm. Accelerator's here. I guess that's it. I guess that's it. Accelerator on you. And then what is this, a second volley? I guess I can reroll that volley. Don't need a laser. Overload sucks. Mr. K's head, I, I don't really care to bring him back, to be honest. Birth cord. Doesn't do enough damage for me. Wait, 30 DPS, okay. Nah, leg wire, nah. Resonance rune, maybe. He will die nearly instantly soon. Whew, that's a little bit scary. Maybe the multi-shot I can start re-rolling. One of them. Guardian Wand. I don't need the Guardian Wand if I'm just gonna do Resonance Rune. Charging mode, don't need. Self-Aware Grimoire. 
I have... Right, I'm just gonna stop there. I'm just gonna stop there. Uh, let's see... Can this thing cast it if the frost thing is over here? Put what on my bottom wand? Oh, the the self-aware or the the thing that makes it uh, like a floating wand around you. I think resonance resonance rune is fine. Is that blue? Let me let me try that out without the blue stuff. I can't tell if that's freezing or not. It's blue, but it's like, is it freezing blue? <laughs> because if I put this before this guy, you know what? I should be putting it over here anyways. So never mind. I'm just wasting my time thinking about something that is ridiculous because we're casting this way more often, this other stuff. So that will freeze more often for us. The two blues shown was different. Man, you got good eyes. I, I'm actually kind of terrible at differentiating uh, certain colors. So maybe that's why I couldn't tell. Like, there's a lot of times I will say something is orange or yellow, and my friends will be like, no, that's the other color. Either orange or yellow. And also blue and greens for some reason. I can definitely see colors and stuff, so it, it's not that bad, but sometimes I just, like, can't tell subtle differences. Endless bottle, 30% chance to gain a new potion every time I consume one. That's kind of cool. Do I need even more movement speed? I don't think I do. Let's take the endless ball just for fun. Choose a relic and reroll it. One to... Restore one to 25 HP. Let's go. This is crazy. I have gotten to this boss multiple times, and if I'm able to survive, it lasts like at least three or four minutes. So I am so surprised that that just went so well. We just found two very, very good spells for uh, trading up. Very cool, very cool. Where should we put the navigation? On our second one? The one that's auto-casting? It works instead of the mouse. Oh, so then I don't even need to spin around with it. Okay, is it is it as strong as the mouse navigation? Let's try it out. Oh, wait a minute. This one's locked in though. It's a little slower. It's locked in though. Really sucks. Randomly upgrade one relic. Let's do it. We did... I couldn't even tell which one got upgraded. If we find another staff where we go into a store though, we can... Oh, there's a store. Um, 25 bucks is not a lot. But we'll see. Ooh, rainbow of electric net. I can't afford it. <laughs> Wait, if I discount it, how much is it going to be? Buy the keys. All right. Well, now I can't buy anything else. And then use the double key one. I can't use it. I don't have a, that potion anymore. I just drank it. <laughs> Yeah, aren't we almost at the end of the game? I drank it for science, for real, yeah. Um, I'm also going to do this for science. I'm gonna drink the discount potion and see if it lets me discount everything after a reroll. Oh, it does! Sick. Wait, where did this Mr. K come from? Has he just been alive this whole time? I don't understand why he's there. Let's use this again. It's the same price. Interesting. So we don't need you. We don't really need you. I'm just gonna move. He will die on the last boss. Probably. I'm surprised that he's lasted this long after I got rid of the spell. 
Well, I guess with Troll's Blood, he recovers HP or something, right? Yeah, he's recovering every once in a while. Yeah, this is this is for real a broken build. Oh, what is that? Oh! Thank God I got pillars. I don't even need that HP. We're done. Oh, I want a blacksmith. So we got another energy saver and a rock and ball, which doesn't really matter. I'm gonna go for the coin room just in case we are able to get to a blacksmith. And then we have some coins to reroll with. Die! Yeah, this, you can't have a normal build and like kill stuff in the stage, you know? Like, I was using very normal builds coming into the stage, and it took forever to clear every single room. Like, it, it even surprises me how long that big skull was staying alive. We got a split, and then we have a tier of goddess, which we probably won't actually use. A locked room, thank god I got the keys. And we have another treasure box here. I guess I'll take it. Transform 20% of HP into coins. You know what? I'm going to keep that around. I'm going to... I'm probably going to just... Can I drink this potion and not reroll anything? Oh, I have to? Oh, no! I wanted to, like, just cancel. You know what I mean? What's wrong with Blade of Fury? You got something against Blade of Fury? I mean, I'll listen to you. Oh, we got a bone armor. That's cool. My crit chance is low. How can you tell? Is there a place that tells you? You got to tell me if you know. Because I, I was actually looking at for that last time. I was on the spells. One. Oh, it's I'm supposed to remember the sequence, aren't I? It was this, 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 this. Hey, I remembered something. Oh, we can double this guy up. Mouse over them. I don't see it. Oh, shit. Where do you see it? If there is none there, I have no crit chance. Yeah, right. I'm critting. I'm critting. There's no way I'm not critting. You're, you know, yeah, yeah, see, there's crit damage coming up. There's probably a base that they don't consider. And it's most likely very low. <laughs> but I am critting very rarely. So yeah, you're right. Blade of, Blade of Fury was not worth it. You see some 21s coming up. Oh, frick. All right, I'm starting to lose HP now. Alright, let's see. I don't want to fall in this hole. So we got Ranger's Boots, Berserker's Eye, which might be useful right now. I'm going to take Berserker's Eye. Hmm. A curse that changes over time. I'm not going to take the risk this close to the end. Um, healing Spring versus Spell Room. I don't think we're going to run into a Forge, so I, I might as well just heal? Oh my god, there's more. How many stages? Does it tell you how many stages are left? That would be really nice to know because then I can like... That would like affect my room choices if I knew I was two rooms away versus five rooms away from the boss kind of thing. Let's 
Okay. We did it. Six-sided dice is gonna be useless right now. I will take the guardian elf. Man. I'm getting scared that I, I'm making some bad decisions here. Because I swear, like, the other levels, I would be at the boss boss stage right now. But here we are standing, still fighting all these normal room enemies. Oh, oh, shh. The stupid confusion ray always gets me. I was just falling down the hole over and over there. My thank you. I, I do feel like I should be as well. Oh, here it is. Let's drink our health potion because might as well do it right now. I don't need that potion. I also don't need the tier of goddess, so I might as well just drink that to see if it drops another potion. It did! Gain 25% of your coins. Okay, I will do that. And I will just hope that it drops another potion. It does not. I don't want to transform 20% of my stuff into potions though, or uh, coins. Here we go, everybody. My first time at the last boss. Unspeakable thing. Ooh. Oh, he's dying. Oh, whoa. Those don't look friendly. Those do not look friendly. Oh, he is so screwed. Oh, he has this confusion ray too. I do not like that. Half of his body is over here. Yeah, I, I don't know how I would have fought this guy with my other builds. They were so much weaker than what we got going on. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa! I don't like that. Now I'm scared to move. Oh, there's something on me. Oh no. I didn't notice a leech on me and now I'm almost dead. Don't do the disruption ray. Don't do the confusion ray. I hate you. Yes. Oh, the leech almost got me too. Don't tell me there's a second form. Is there a second form or something? What's going on? They're blasting something over here. I was so scared of a second form. This, this warp is screwing me over. All right, let's interact with the corpse of this thing. Ha ha, is this the end? I am indeed a genius. No one knows what's going on here. None of the people who stepped into the hallway came back. But I had a bad prom prem premonition that the legendary ancient gods do not look like this. They're even more magnificent. Oh crap. Well, this is a big jump. This is the essence contained in the magic object. I can feel the powerful magic. There is no way ahead if you don't let it go and take it back for research. There may be some gains. All right, let's take it back. What? What is a slow fade? Oh, back to <laughs> back to our bedroom. I forgot that this is how we started. So why is that guy still AFK? Nature calls? I don't know. Prob falling in the pit. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. Have you reached the deepest part of the corridor? It's unbelievable to be able to come back alive from there. That's amazing, Hero. I dare not approach that place. Hero, what is that thing you brought back? <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised that they didn't say that first, to be honest, because it's so large. I don't know. Bring it back to see if it's okay to eat. <laughs> well, this is the essence of magic object. Of the ma magic object. It's too wasteful to eat it. Only high level monsters can have this kind of thing. It seems that I underestimated you and could actually kill such level monsters. This is a great treasure. Give me some time to study. I can discover many good things. Sure thing, professor. Now everyone wants to talk. Studying the essence of the ancient god, the following spells have been discovered. I'm always down for more spells in this game. Woohoo is correct. I can't wait to see it. I hope they're OP as hell. Hero, since you brought back the meatball, <laughs> meatball last time, the monsters in the forest have become even more irritable. 
Something seems to be appearing in the distance. They are affecting the creatures of this world. Please be more careful when going out. Totally. We need some more meta progression. I wonder what's down here. Should we just unlock it? Let's just unlock it. Mm, I don't love it. What, what exactly does this mean? Does it mean more chance to show up with a health room or spell room? Or does it mean you get more stuff per room? If it's the latter, I'm very interested. Gives you more HP per room, and spell room gives you more spells per room, right? Like instead of giving you two, it gives you three? Rarity chance. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I will think about this later. I will do this later. Oh, it's the max health room. Right, right. Um, cool, that's our first clear. First clear. Thank you so much, Wet Paper Bag, for giving me that awesome suggestion for the tracking snakes. That worked out really, really well. It was super, super fun. Uh, I'm ready to try different types of builds for sure. There's obviously some things that I'm not thinking about where you can synergize something with a spell to make it just go off the walls. So we're going to go jump back into Magic Craft again sometime soon. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it here. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. And that's all we got for Magic Craft today. So tune in again soon to see some more.